The detection system will help government trace the spread of the coronavirus and identify COVID-19 hotspots. The testing method was imported from the Dutch Institute in Netherlands by Amanze Water with the Green Hill Laboratories. What we're hoping to do is, when it's rolled out nationally, is be able to coordinate our resources better. So if we can identify community hotspots for COVID-19 pandemic, we can then relay that information to the Department of Health, who could then potentially send um, healthcare workers into that particular community. We'll then say to them, look, we'll monitor community B and C, but community A looks like it's a potential hotspot. We can see the viral load increase in that community. Send more healthcare workers that side, and we'll continue to monitor the other communities. The information has also been shared with the Department of Water Affairs and Sanitation. The Muncie for All have approached the Department of Water and Sanitation and submitted a report to them. Um, And we're hoping that they'll be able to roll it out nationally, um, along with a number of other partners working on the same um, project. Um, But local municipalities and uh, in charge of their own wastewater treatment works are welcome to contact us um, to, to start the process from their side. It is hoped that the municipalities will also use the system in their areas. South Africa is the fifth highest number of recorded COVID-19 cases in the world, and they continue to increase daily. Tulanim Simanga, SAPC News, Hilton.